Um, if anybody, if you guys have the oil in front of you, if you have the orange in front of you, um, you could crack it open and you could take a whiff of it. Um, if you want to put a couple drops on the palm of your hand and just rub your hands together and inhale, you can do that. Um, that's one way to use it topically. But even if you just want to smell it straight from the bottle, it's very uplifting. It's very, uh, very much an oil of happiness and sunshine in a bottle. <laughs> it does smell amazing. Yes. So fresh. Okay, well, if, do you want to get started? Sure. Okay, awesome. Well, um, so my name is Andrea Staley. I'm so happy to be with you today and to chat with you. Uh, my family and I live in Peters Township. We just moved from Mount Lebanon a few months ago. We moved during all of this madness, which was a little crazy. Um, I have a daughter, Olivia, who's three, and I am due with our second baby a week from today. <laughs> so um, very close. Uh, I have been with doTERRA essential oils for nine years and first discovered them. Uh, my mom actually discovered them. She had suffered from an autoimmune disease for 20 plus years um, and found an oil that significantly worked for her and pretty much changed her life um, and then got me involved. And um, I've basically been sharing it with people for nine years and educating people on why doTERRA, how to use oils. Um, this company is truly amazing. Uh, they set themselves apart from every other company. So you really probably have seen oils at Marshall's, TJ Maxx, Whole Foods. They sell them everywhere now. You can't turn on the TV without seeing uh, a commercial. There's a commercial for Raid right now with oils in them, <laughs> uh, which is, seems completely ironic, but um, most companies, when they say pure essential oils, they are not pure. They're typically synthetic um, and they're carcinogenic and they're just not good for us. Um, so doTERRA is actually a company of, so there's about 10 million of us wellness advocates who share the oils, but they've grown into basically the top leading global company of essential oils in the world. Um, we source every oil where it's grown best in the world. So if a crop is bad, they will not bottle it. Um, our, the, the wild orange that you have in front of you is from the Dominican Republic, and it's steam distilled from the rind of the fruit. Um, our oils are certified pure therapeutic grade. So they're actually tested 54 different ways, every single bottle. Um, and they're tested by a third party lab as well. Um, when it comes to oils, you really wanna make sure you're using the most pure ingredient and the most pure oil. So doTERRA's are the most, most pure on the market. You can use them aromatically in a diffuser, which I have behind me. You can use them topically on your body. You can use them internally. So I actually take we have a whole um, supplement line and vitamins and I take all that and I actually put the orange directly in my water a couple drops. Um, skipping coffee this morning and using or orange instead and it gives a great energy boost without needing caffeine, which is awesome. Um, some other things just about doTERRA before I jump into how to use the oil. Uh, we're based in Salt Lake City, but this company is global around the world. Um, We've incorporated and been implementing our oils in universities, hospitals, um, through different healthcare. Uh, we have a healthcare company called Prime Meridian, and we're basically opening up little sort of wellness centers and integrative centers that are combining traditional medicine with holistic practices. And actually, doctors are prescribing oils to patients, which is super interesting. Um, we also, like I said before, where we source the oils, it's called co-impact sourcing. And so we hire farmers and the people who grow these oils and the fruits and the plants of these oils the best around the world, we hire them. And we've actually built jobs and infrastructure and all these things around the world that are employing farmers and, and people who are out of work. Um, and now they're bottling hundreds of thousands and millions of bottles of oils for us, which is really, really awesome. 
Um, some other things, if you do want to ever check the bottom of the bottle of your oil to see where it was uh, from, there's a little code on the bottom. So if you go to source to you.com, you can actually see where and when this was bottled, which is really, really cool. Um, and so, like I said, you know, our company is the most tested, most trusted. Um, I, I would never intake internally another oil company ever in my life. And I would never use these on my, never use another company's on my daughter um, or through my pregnancies. And I've used doTERRA through both pregnancies. And my daughter, who is three, has never had a day without doTERRA, which is awesome. <laughs> we have found um, so many solutions for her when it comes to um, immune support and building her immune system and protecting um, from viruses and sicknesses and things. Um, we have used it for stomach discomfort, um, head tension, um, frankincense up her spine to support um, positive cells. I mean, there are so many, so many great ways and uses. Um, and I just love sharing doTERRA with, with everyone because it's just, it's, it's profound. It's, there, it's an amazing company and amazing what the oils can do. Um, so if we talk about wild orange, if you want to smell it again, take a good whiff. Um, it is one of our most popular oils and it's one of the most inexpensive too. It's kind of has an amazing story of how they bottle it as well. So in your free time, if you look up um, on YouTube, there's a video, a sourcing video of how they source it in the Dominican. Um, but it is very, as you can tell, it's very uplifting, very cheerful. Um, it is purifying. So you can put a couple drops in a diffuser if you have one. Um, it will purify the air. It's really good for easing anxious feelings. So um, it's one I take on an airplane, which I know none of us are really flying right now, but it's a really great one to take with you. Um, and you, it's funny, you use it, you put a couple drops on your wrist and you, you breathe in and you can kind of see everybody else around you relax too, which is awesome. Um, it also can be used for stomach discomfort, which is surprising. A lot of people don't realize that. Uh, you can put a couple drops in your water for just detoxing. Um, it's a great immune support. So it actually is one of the oils with the highest levels of limonene. So limonene is found in many citrus fruits. Um, but this is coming from the rind. It's not coming from the juice of the fruit. So you're getting that really powerful, potent um, punch. And, and one to two drops of the oil go a very long way. So always remember that. Um, one of my favorite ways to use it, too, is to combine it with our peppermint and frankincense, which I actually have the peppermint here. Um, and a fun fact about peppermint, it actually is the equivalent of 52, the, the potency of 52 cups of peppermint tea, which is a lot. <laughs> so uh, one drop of peppermint goes a very long way. Um, and I was just learning more about the, the we, we steam distill our peppermint in the state of Washington, but we also have recently hired an amazing family of farmers in India who are also giving us a variety of peppermint that they have grown. Um, and like I said before, you know, this company travels around the world and makes sure that soil levels are correct and everything is done organically and naturally. And, you know, there are no additives in this bottle. It is the straight oil in every single bottle. Um, and it truly is the most tested and most trusted. And you can be sure that whatever you're taking or putting in your water or using on your body is 100% pure and it's, it's truly amazing. Um, the other way that I like to use wild orange, which you can put it on the bottoms of your feet, um, and I'm not sure if any of you know this or if you've used oils before, but the bottoms of your feet have our biggest pores in our body, so the oil will go in your bloodstream within 20 seconds, um, and it's one of the fastest ways to have your body absorb an oil. So uh, there are many grounding oils that are really good for that. There are oils I use before doing yoga or something that actually help with balance and I put them right on my feet. Um, that's another way you can use wild orange. You can also cook and bake with it, um, which I've made wild orange cookies before and they're amazing. Um, when you do add the oils to heat though, they lose their therapeutic benefits. So if you were to say to add it to yogurt or something, 
and you know not be cooking with it but just add it to your food that's one of the ways to reap the benefits of you know it being therapeutic versus sort of um, adding heat to it um, the other oil that is my favorite that I wanted to talk about because I do think and I feel um, I'm not alone in this feeling that it should be in every home is called on guard I don't know if you've heard of doTERRA's on guard but it has wild orange in it um, and it's a blend of rosemary, clove, cinnamon, wild orange, um, and eucalyptus. And it's amazing for um, protecting against viruses. Um, it's amazing for immune support, building your immunity up. Um, it's probably the most widely used needed oil right now in everything that's going on. Um, and we have a sanitizing mist, we have laundry detergent, we have a cleaning concentrate, we have toothpaste, um, which is being reformulated right now, and it has wild orange in it. So there are very um, immune supporting properties in this wild orange that go a very long way when you're trying to achieve optimal health and just build up your immune system to be able to protect against anything. Yes, you have a question. Yeah, um, so with the On Guard, do you put it like on your wrist every day or something or do you like yeah, so one way that i use it every single day which i can tell you for through two pregnancies now i take a soft gel of it internally so uh, we have a soft gel and it's called on guard plus it actually has black pepper and melissa oil in it and melissa is one of the bacteria fighting um it's one of the main immune support oils that you can use it also has oregano in it um, and I take that every single day. But if you were just to use the straight oil, I would suggest putting it on the bottoms of your feet. Um, that's actually the best, one of the best ways, that's how my husband uses it every day. Um, I take the soft gel every day. I also diffuse it. Um, there are so many ways to use On Guard and incorporate it. But yeah, that's, that's probably the best, the best way. Um, and the On Guard too, um, I will say if you take it internally, I mean, many people just drop it right under their tongue. Um, it is a little bit of a spicier oil because it has cinnamon, clove. Some people love the taste, um, but I can truly say that taking it every single day, I feel very protected and very like a shield around me, which is, is nice. And then for my daughter, um, we have a diluted roll-on for children. So... Um, I did send in the note that Michelle, the flyer that Michelle put up, there's a picture of a kid's kit with all the different colors. So that is a set of oils that are formulated for kids. They're diluted with fractionated coconut oil. They're formulated to do what exactly they say. So one is called Thinker. It's really great for focus. Um, one is called Rescuer. We've been using that a lot on boo-boos and scrapes and scratches. And um, it is truly, it, it's very... Um, it works. Um, but the other kids line that we have, that's the touch kit, also has an on guard roll on. So it's diluted with fractionated coconut oil, but you can roll it right on. So a lot of people will roll it right up their spine, on their neck, on their wrists, feet for like an added protection. Um, or you could use the straight oil kind of in the ways that I said. But Andrea, I have a question. Yeah. Um, yeah. I do have the uh, set of the roll-on bottles. And, okay. Um, which, which set do you have? The kids or the touch? The kids kit or the touch kit? No, the touch kit. Okay. So how many drops of oil do you include in with the fractionated coconut oil? So how many are already in there? You no. When you, when you put it into the roll-on with the coconut oil, how many drops do you add to that so, Okay, so you're talking about making a roll-on. Yes. Right? Okay. Um, it depends. I typically, you know, are you using it for yourself or for kids or okay. So you could make it a little stronger. Um, typically when you formulate a blend, and it's it's interesting how blends actually work amazingly well together, and when you layer oils, they work even better. Um, and I'm sort of learning more about this now because um, I've always been to laying, into layering oils, into using blends and different things. In fact, I just made up my whole hospital bag of oils um, and they're all blends and they're all roll-ons. And most of them were like two drops of each oil and then you top it with coconut oil. Okay. Um, it depends on what it's for though. Are, are, you, are you using it for something specific or? 
Well, I like the um, I like the thought of on guard um, <laughs> being rolled on. So yeah, for example, if you were just to do straight roll on or straight on guard for yourself, I would do five to ten drops mm -hmm. and then top it with coconut oil. Okay. Uh, if you were to do it for a child, I would do five. Probably okay. I'd keep it at five and top it. Um, and then, you know, if you didn't want to make it yourself too, if you, if you do have the touch kit and you just want to use the touch oils, they're already formulated, um, specifically Digestin, the one for stomach, okay. um, one that I use, you know, consistently. Oh, do you have to go? Thanks, Lori. Reach out to me if you have questions. Thank you. We really appreciate it. Oh, you're welcome. Have a great day. Have a good day. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Um, so yeah, I mean, I would, so do you have like just roll ons that you want to add to, to make a bunch of different blends then? Yeah, that's what okay. I was thinking. And I just wasn't sure. I, I, you did answer my question though, about how much, how many drops to the amount of oil that coconut yeah, oil. Yeah, and we can, um, you know, if there's, if you ever have questions about like a certain recipe, I have so many roll on blend recipes for so many things, even just, um, head tension, stomach discomfort. I mean, there's, there are a number of oils you can add to together to make, to work even better than just the single oil itself. So. Okay, great. Yeah. I'll reach out if I yeah. need some advice. <laughs> yeah, of course. I'm always here to, to provide that for sure. Um, okay. Do you have a sorry, question? I just have another. Yeah. yeah. Sorry, I have a question. <laughs> um, so the touch kit, so that comes with roll-ons and then you have to make the roll-ons or no sorry if we confused you so <laughs> you can so you can purchase roll-on bottles separately there's a, a couple like third-party sites that we have aroma tools oil life they sell roll-on bottles that you actually can make stuff yourself um and a lot of people do do diy and they'll they'll buy like the straight oil in a kit and then make their own stuff um, but the touch kit itself takes that that um, part of it out of there. So you're not doing the DIY. And it comes with 10 roll-ons that are already pre-formulated, ready to roll on, crack open, and roll on when you're ready to use them. So, and they're actually 10 of the most. So we, we have a kit, um, our Healthy Home Kit is like 10 of our most versatile oils that you can use in every way. There's lemon, lavender, peppermint, oregano, digestin, which is for stomach, on guard, frankincense, which is a whole different amazing topic to talk about separately. Um, but those oils come in a straight kit not being diluted with the roll-on and they also come as a roll-on. So you can do either way. The roll-ons are most popular for children um, and I've been using them on my daughter, you know, every single day. There's like five of them that I literally have kept in my diaper bag in her bathroom. I mean, and that's the ones we go to every single night, every single day. Um, but if you were to get started with doTERRA and you say wanted a diffuser, I would suggest to do the straight oil. And then you can always get the accessories to make some other things if you want to use those to make them. Um, and then maybe get the touch kit down the road. But you know, some people love the touch kit. I actually, I'm suggesting something to a friend who's having some skin issues and we have a tea tree touch oil that's amazing for spot treatment for face, um, even just to roll on like a bug bite. It's, it's, um, it's can very convenient to have the roll on. So there are a lot of people that choose that over the straight oil and it's not you're not getting less um, when you actually dilute with fractionated coconut oil you're using less of the oil but the coconut oil actually drives the oil into your skin even more so um, there are pluses and minuses there's not really any minuses but there are pluses to both the uh, options and you could use them in different ways so yeah does that answer your question <laughs> okay yeah thank you of course yeah and you can reach out to me. Um, I'll, I'll chat you my cell and my email because I don't think you have it. Um, but I can definitely, um, we could even set up a separate time to talk if you want. I'm always open for that. <laughs> um, do you have any other questions at all? I have one question. Yeah. You may not have ever been asked this or you might have. Can you use these on animals? 
Yes, and actually on Thursday, I just did a class on pets and essential oils. Okay. Um, so there are different things that people read about that say oils are poisonous to pets and you shouldn't use certain things. And, and one, um, tea tree is one that you shouldn't use with cats. Um, and that's just because what makes up tea tree is actually not good for their liver in enzymes, like their livers can't break it down. So you just wouldn't want to use it around them or with them. I have two cats um, here and I've been using oils for nine years and I've never had any issues. Um, but you can use oils with pets. Um, there's a really, really great veterinarian that you should check out. Her name's Dr. Janet Rourke. It's R-O-A-R-K-E. She's on our veterinary panel board. So we have a whole board that's of uh, vets that sit on our board that basically have studied the science and the research and what oils can be used for what. Um, there are some amazing, actually the class I taught on Thursday, we broke it down by ailment. So cardiovascular, um, stomach, we broke it down by like what oils you could use for what. It was mostly geared toward dogs, but it, it can apply to other pets too. Okay. Um, are you looking for something specific or? Yeah, you know what, I will email you and okay. let me know what I'm looking for because I, I, uh, I am looking for something specific and I think I want to try it. So yeah. Email to yeah, and a little bit goes a long way. You know, um, animals have a lot more sense receptors than we do. They have like millions and okay. we have thousands. So, um, you know, a little bit goes a long way with pets, but I've seen really profound results. I actually have someone on my team who's using them on her horses mm -hmm. um, and actually getting her horses to eat better and um, to eat more <laughs> by using oils. Yeah. Um, I have so many testimonials of pets and oils. So yeah, I'd be happy to share with you. I will certainly email you. Thank okay. you. Yeah, sure. Any other questions at all? Riley, do you have any questions? Or your mom? No? No. No. Okay. <laughs> all right. Well, yeah, Rachel and Michelle, reach out to me um, and let me know when you want to chat. Um, I set up Zoom calls like this all the time or talk on the phone. Um, I'm here to educate and explain. I can give you samples of things and we can we can chat offline for sure. Okay, great. That sounds yeah. wonderful. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, have a good weekend, everybody. You too. Thank you, you so too. much. And it was nice to meet you. Oh, it was nice to meet you. Oh, it was nice to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> all, right. all right, everyone, have a good weekend. Thank you, you too. Bye. Okay, bye. -bye. bye, -bye.